throw them out there like they were animals. <laughs> A grieving mother in search of justice after the possible remains of her missing son and his girlfriend were discovered days after a man was arrested for their murders. As ABC 10 News reporter Michael Chen tells us, family members say the couple had recently met and fallen in love. His emptiness broken. For Maria Moore, the shock and grief remain overwhelming. Just knowing that I'm never going to see him again is unbearable. In January, Moore, who lives in Tennessee, says her son, 30-year-old Escondido native Angel Ponce, stopped returning her calls. I started worrying more and more about him. In mid-February, loved ones filed a missing persons report. Maria says last year her son had met someone special, a woman named Danielle Ricker. He was really in love with her. They were living together. Both Ponce and Ricker were reported missing in February. The focus soon shifting to Ricker's ex-boyfriend. According to the Riverside County Sheriff's Department, a tip led to a February 27th search warrant at the home of David Floyd in Temecula. He was then arrested in connection with two murders. Then on March 2nd, the remains of two people were found near an intersection in the Hemet area. Deputies say the remains are believed to be of the missing couple. Throw them out there like they were animals. <laughs> Moore calls her son, who worked for an asphalt company for about a decade, a fun-loving father of two. She says investigators told her a fight led to the murders. He was jealous of my son, and he wanted to have a relationship with Daniel. Moore now demanding the justice system hold the accused killer accountable. Death penalty, I'm okay with that too, but I prefer him suffer for life instead of justice. Michael Chen, ABC 10 News. Lloyd will be arraigned on the murder charges next week. A GoFundMe campaign has been set up to help the family with expenses. There is a link on our homepage, 10news.com.